Hello, welcome to Pandora's Box. Today, I will rank the top 10 cards from Cardfight Vanguard, Twinkle Melody, according to concept and quality of illustration. Like Recos, this is a dream product full of big busty waifus and young lollies. The artwork is not as lewd as Wycos, but I think it's more sexy if I need to use my imagination. Here is my top 10 list of the most beautiful cards in Twinkle Melody. First and number 10, I have Direct Squirt, Elshi. One of the first things that come to mind is, who does the naming for these characters? Who calls themselves Direct Squirt? The flavor text makes it even more lewd. Two pumps on the skin. Hmm, I mean okay, when do you want me to unload? I mean, oh, oh wait, you were talking about the perfume. Oh yeah, okay, yeah, so was I. And number 9 is Glittery Baby Lean by Gun. I understand that they are all mermaids and the buoyancy of the water can help with the weight of their enormous boobs. But at some point, you have to wonder if diminishing returns will set in and the drag that those boobs create will overshoot the buoyancy. I have a curious mind and this is a completely legitimate and scientific concern. And number 8 is Direct Sign Push. After Direct Squirt, there is Direct Sign. This is the bustiest and most beautiful out of the goldfish triplets. Should I just pull down my pants and flash myself to her? Is this sign direct enough? And number 7, I have Velvet Voice, Reindeer. Her dress looks translucent and silky. I wonder how the cloth feels against her soft skin. Again, this is a completely legitimate concern. At number 6, I have Bear Affection, Lara. I'm glad that the mermaids in Cardfight Vanguard have proper rooms to live in. I imagine it would be difficult for them if they had to live like mermaids from Disney. It is comfortable to do certain exercises on an actual bed then roll around on the coarse gravelly sea bed. At number 5, I have Heart Fragrance, Lesher. <laughs> this is the infamous alternating boobs. It is probably like that because she's jumping for joy and one of her boobs is made of silicone. And at number 4, I have Expect Rhythm, Viera. Sometimes I feel that Cutfight Vanguard is trolling us with the names and the flavor text. This waifu expects rhythm because she wants to attain that beautiful sound and brilliant time. I can't really do anything about the size of my dick, but I sure can practice to get myself in rhythm. Jokes aside, this card is immaculately illustrated. Then at number 3, I have Perfect Performance, Angel. It really feels like a day out on the beach. The artist even drew in solar flare to mimic the properties of an actual photograph. I am the tiny cat in the picture with heart-shaped eyes. Finally at number 2, I have Perfect Performance, Angel. This is the same girl as just now, just drawn in a different form. Here, she is a perfume sales girl. I don't know the dynamics of mermaids using perfume underwater. I mean like, wouldn't the seawater just wash everything off? I mean, how do you even apply the perfume in the first place? Maybe the mermaids all really need it because they all smell like fish. Before I review the number one cut of Twinkle Melody, let's look at some honourable mentions. This list consists of big bustly waifus who, unfortunately, were not big enough to make it into the top 10. My first honourable mention is Velvet Voice, Reindeer. Miss Silky Soft Dress makes another appearance here. She looks like she's going for a funeral rather than a fun day on the beach though. Next is Happiness Heart, Lupina. Lupina is the poster girl for this set. My heart also fills up with happiness every time I see her. My next honourable mention is Squee Toll, Olivia. I put this here more for the background scenery than the actual waifu herself. Of course, extra skin doesn't hurt. My last honourable mention is Star on Stage, Plon. She has a face of a lolly, but the body of a milf. Usually, I would have preferred it if it was the other way around. Before I review the number one card for Twinkle Melody, please remember to like and subscribe to Pandora's Box. I post new videos daily, so please remember to check back for more content like this. The number one most beautiful card in Twinkle Melody is Perfect Performance Angel. Yes, you are not seeing triple. The three different arts of this beautiful waifu takes all the top three spots in Twinkle Melody. I do not want to say that I have a type because I want to be accommodating and be available to as many varieties of waifus as possible. But Angel is probably as close to my type 
if I do have one. She also wins the Best Wife of Twinkle Melody Award. I don't know what it is about her that makes her so attractive. Maybe it's her pink hair, maybe it's her tight body, or maybe because she's made of cardboard. I'm not sure. But I do know that she is beautiful enough to beat out a sea of waifus to be the number one most beautiful card of Twinkle Melody. This is my list for the top 10 cards in Card Fight Vanguard Twinkle Melody. If you are a man of culture and you want to see more big busty waifus like this, please visit my channel for more box openings, set reviews, top 10s, and content curated for nerds in general. I'll see you in the next video. Bye bye!